<clears throat> hey YouTube, this is Makaya again. Uh, I have just washed my hair. I used the VO5. I used, I decided to go with my coconut milk conditioner, no shampoo, and the mixed chicks deep conditioner. Here's my hair, soppy wet. Now, okay, here's the thing. You are not supposed to uh, dry your hair or your uh, towel dry it. It is supposed to be soppy wet. And so as I'm going to be working this, I am going to use my little trusty water bottle that I use all the time. In here has leave-in conditioner. It has water. It has olive oil. Um, yeah, a little mix. Grapeseed oil. And I am going to continue to saturate my hair. Now, the thing they say on the Kinky Curly is that they want you to separate and um, wide tooth comb your hair while you still have conditioner in it. Now, um, if you have thicker hair, I recommend you doing that. I don't have thick hair. My hair is straight, thin, and not, I, my hair doesn't tangle unless I'm using some crazy shampoo but it I can just finger comb through my hair now shout out goes to Renee Zoe because I was watching other kinky curly custard videos and they were doing different things I liked hers because again I don't want my hair to be really really curly and I've looked at the kinky curly uh, website they have different hair textures and all that kind of thing but this is what she did that just made a light bulb go out on me she basically twisted her hair while she was using the kinky curly. She flat twisted hers. Now, when she unraveled it, it came out big fat curls. What I'm going to do, just to try this out, if not, I'll be wearing a puff tonight at the Beverly, Beverly Crawford concert. Um, I'm gonna twist my hair. Now, does it take a long time to dry? Absolutely, absolutely. So I'm doing this really early because I know that tonight um, we have a concert. So hopefully um, 10 hours should make it dry. If not, the hair dryer will be coming out. So this is what I'm going to do. I am going to section my hair off into many places. And as y'all can see, y'all see my hair is really white, y'all. I wasn't playing. And this is actually coloring my hair last week after I took that mess out. Yeah, last week. Now... I am, I normally, when I do my hair, I put everything going back because I like stuff off my face. But because I have to kind of shape it the way that I want it to go because I am going to be twisting this, is that I am kind of spreading it out a little bit. Okay? Now, what I'm going to do is that I'm getting my wide tooth comb and I am going to get the kinky curly custard. Now, my mom has been using this for a year, and you see, she still got a whole bunch, but she has a, a tiny little fro, and um, she didn't have to use that much. Basically, my mama would wash her hair and go. That's it. Um, and it was short, so she didn't have to do any twists. I'm doing twists, because I want my curl pattern to be a certain way. So, what I'm going to do, I'm only going to use a little, and I'm going to start piecing this stuff out. Here we go. I'm only going to use maybe a fingertip piece because, again, my hair isn't thick. And I am going to start twisting as I put it in. I'm hoping this comes out of the way. Like I said, um, Renee Zoe did flat twists. I'm just going to do little twists and see what happens. Again, I'm gonna make them bigger. I just like the tiny ones in the front. Again, not even a dime size. Just enough to get my hair wet. That's not even a lot. Putting it in, gonna twist. So, yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Again, a 
little on my hair twist now as I was saying before I have watched a lot of kinky curly custard videos and this one lady she did a comparison between kinky curly custard and uh, I think that's that Fantasia ice olive oil gel because you know this is a styling gel and I really I have my styling gels y'all know how much I'm in love with Proline so um yeah um she did a comparison and her comparison came out that they pretty much did the same thing Kiki Curly and the straight I mean the um Fantasia Icy Gel I've never used Icy Gel simply because I'm not really a gel girl I kind of like my hair to just do its own thing because it's gonna do its own thing anyway but I her hair was short so I'm not really sure what it's going to do with longer hair. Um, little twist. And um, this is the thing that I'm going to do once this stuff dries. I am going to uh, as I'm twisting it, I mean, as I'm untwisting it once it's dry, I'm going to get my vegetable glycerin and just put it on the ends because um, for some reason my hair was really, 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 really tight and it was cute, but it was tight and I wasn't really feeling it. But I combed out the curls, which still stayed, and um, it, it, it did better with the glycerin on it. I don't know it just did so I'm gonna do this I'm gonna let this dry I'm gonna come back to you once it's dry hopefully it will be today cuz I got let me mention I got a concert tonight um and I will let you know how it comes out you all have a wonderful day happy Easter and I'll catch y'all in about a couple of hours